Hello guys, my name is Master Gamer GZ of the Gaming Zone, and welcome to Pix Evo The Fountain. I don't really know what this is, all I know is it's an action platformer that's also based on pixels and retro with evolution. So let's just get right into it. The fountain is eternal. Wake up, start moving. Okay. So this is me, huh? I jump around and I eat. Okay. Ah! Ah! Apparently I have to eat four of these, so let's see what I got. You feel like your life force commons back slowly. Come. You feel your life force commons back slowly? Is that what that just said? Okay. <laughs> so I have to eat all these little boxes in order to get more size and be able to do more. Interesting. Okay. I wish I didn't have to jump everywhere because this is going to get kind of annoying, but oh well. Oh, I'm not even big enough for this? Okay, let's see. How do I get over here then? Where is there more dots I can collect? I feel like Pac-Man walking around eating dots. But instead of being a circle, I'm a box. So let's see. Maybe the dots I need to eat are this way? Yeah. Yeah, there's some. Okay. And there's a switch. Let's see what that does. There's also a gate. Let's see. How do I turn the switch? I don't know. Maybe I have to be bigger for that. I think I could get this one last dot. Ugh. Yeah, I could definitely. I got it. Stand and walk to go faster and higher. Oh. Cool. This is awesome. I'm getting bigger and evolving. I, I knew it was about evolution, but I didn't know it was going to be like this. This is a really interesting puzzle game. I'm not even usually into platformers like this. Alright. So, our guy looks really funny. He's like a little box with legs. Like, there's not even anything else to note about him. Sorry about background sound. Not my fault. I can't really control it. Anyway, um, alright, so let's get all these dots. This music's kind of rocking, too. Alright, and let's continue to get these dots, because dots are what we need in life, apparently. Can't get through that gate yet. I think we have to flip those switches. I can only get one of those dots yet, so... I think I can get up there now, though, and get all those dots, so let's see. This way, ah, oh, I can definitely get up there, but I, it's going to take a little bit of work. I got a dot. Ugh! I didn't get that one. I can't get that one from there. I have to get a little higher up for that. Ugh. Some of these hitboxes look like they should work because of the legs, but they don't. It's all based on the box that my guy is. Ugh. Here we go. Let's get out here and get all this. Oh, I can't even get that from there? Okay. So now I need 16 of these dots in order to increase size again, and I've only got 9, so we gotta get up here and get more dots, because I don't think there's more down there we can really get. Alright, we can't activate that switch yet, I don't think. Ah, uh, I don't think we could get that yet. I hope I'm right about that, because otherwise I'm wasting time coming over here. Ugh. Up here, I know there's definitely a way to get that dot. Got it. Alright. Okay, can't get in there yet. After this, we need five more dots? Not after this. This is how much we need now. Oh, come on. I was close to that. If I was going to fall, at least I could have gotten that dot. Fine, I'm going to do it on purpose. There we go. We got one of the dots we needed. I got to get back up there, though. Lots of backtracking in this, because it's all just one giant level. It's interesting, though, because you just learn to maneuver the level as you get bigger and get new abilities. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to evolve arms next and be able to flip these switches. But then I don't know what I'm going to get. I don't know what comes after that. I've never seen anything of it. I'm just assuming, because, like, that's how this game seems to be going. Okay, that worked. Ah, I only need one more. Alright, maybe it's over here. Let's go see. I don't know. It could be right up here. It could be this one over here. I don't know. Could be the last dot I need. Seems like I'm having trouble getting somewhere I've already gotten, so it's very possible that I could have just missed the ability to get that 
Okay, that didn't work. Darn. Darn it! Okay. Ugh! Make your jumps, little block man. Yes, you did it! With formed arms, you can interact. E or shift. Or enter. Okay, so that I can use the, uh... The switches now. Sweet. Oh. Okay. It's gonna be one of these. Okay, I got it. That's a cool little formation it made. Ugh. I can make really high jumps now, too. Should make platforming much easier. Now I have to get 32 in order to upgrade myself again. Get everything I know I can first, so I don't have to backtrack as much. Try your artist case, hey! You got this! Oh, come on. It's so hard to stand on the corner of things. Ugh! I got one. Got another. I don't know if I can get that one up there, though. I think I have to get a little bit bigger for that. Yeah, definitely. Because I think I'm standing right on the edge of that. And if I am, then... Okay, no, I got it. <laughs> I was just not doing things right. Got another one. I know for sure I can't get that one way up there. Okay, uh, it looks like I'm about halfway... Oh, uh, really? Alright, I guess I'm going to get the ones down here now first. Since... That seems to be the way I have to go now. Having failed at this. Um, can I even get these yet? Even being tall, I can't get those yet. And with arms. I wonder what the next evolution's even gonna be. Like, where can you go from here? I'm tall and have arms. Alright, we got more dots over here and a whole opening I haven't been to. Let's see what's down here. More dots. Perfectly okay with more dots any day. It seems like a lot of these dots can be collected at any time, but a lot of them also require certain sizes, and they know you'll be there for them because of the limit of dots you have to have in order to increase in size. But it doesn't seem that limited, is what I'm saying. Some seem flexible with what size you can be. Darn it! I can't get that one up there. Then it's being a bitch. Mm. Hmm. Damn it. Um. Okay. Ugh. Failing at these jumps is annoying in the platformer. This is why I don't like platforming games as much. I'm not as good at them. Okay, I don't think I can get that one yet. I think I can get that other dot, though. And I'm going to keep trying at this one, because I think I might be able to get it. It's possible. Yes, I got it! Couldn't get that, though. Hmm. From over here, I'm going to have to go up and see what up here I could get now, that I wasn't able to before. Of course, that'll obviously be stuff. There's going to be some of those things. Already got three just coming back up here. Can't get that one all the way up there in the corner though. Oh wow, that was so close too. I'm at 26 out of 32, so I need like eight more. Or wait, no, that would be six more. What am I saying? Math. <laughs> Okay. Make that five. This thing's still being a problem, though. A big problem. I can't get up there. Then again, I've had these types of situations before and gotten myself out of them. So I don't know that this is going to last. Okay, I could definitely get that one dot, though, and I definitely need to, because if I don't then I'm going to have to get five from elsewhere, and I don't even know if that's possible. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. It's getting really annoying even trying to get this one dot. Got it. Okay. We got to get back up there where I missed dots before. 
because that's definitely where the other four I'm needing are. And I fell off before, and that's gonna get really bad if it continues. I'm also curious if I can open any of those doors yet, or how that's gonna work. Because there's a lot of dots in there. And I think maybe these switches are gonna mess with other doors, so I'll have to go around and figure that stuff out. I'm not 100% sure. Yes! I can fly? Cool! That's what I was thinking, but I didn't know if that was actually something they were going to do. Now I have to get 64. Wow. But I can fly. Which makes maneuvering the map a lot easier. But only for so long. Hmm, can I get up here? No, almost. No wonder there were so many so high up. I couldn't get them yet because I couldn't fly. This makes things a lot easier. Like, wow, I didn't expect flying would be something I actually got to do around in this game. But it makes a lot more sense now, looking at where things have been placed. Some places seem specifically put there for flying, which is obviously the case. Because that's how the game's designed. I don't know why I'm even describing that. If you guys have been watching up till this point, you would know this. Still can't fly through walls. Probably switches out there that will allow me to get in there. So yeah, you can't reverse the switch. So that is a good sign that I'm not going to have to deal with switch problems that go hand in hand with other ones. And that's a very comforting thought actually because I don't want to have to deal with that. That seems like it would be a very difficult puzzle. I made it! Yes! Okay, this must be where all the dots are. There they are. Yes. I knew I was missing something. Still have a lot of dots to go though. Before I can get any other kind of upgrade. Sorry if you hear any background noise at all. I can't control what other people do around me. But um, anyway. So I'm gonna just continue collecting these dots. As a flying angel of, of dot hood that I am. I won't let your your dots get touched inappropriately because I have to eat them in order to evolve past the span of wings and onto something better. Wow, something I can't even reach flying. But I know how to do it. I have to get up there and then I have to drop down and catch myself with my wings. That's how I'm going to have to do that. Like this. That's not smart. Like that. There we go. Can't get up there from there. No! Wow, I actually made it again. Way easier than I thought I would. Like, way easier than I thought I would. Wow. Alright, I gotta get back up there. There's definitely more dots. Making it so far. Yes, I made it to the other side of this. There's another switch I can activate to get these two dots. We're almost there to the next evolution. Let's see. Got this, got that. Yes, I can barely reach that. Ugh. Making it so far. So many places to go. 
I was crick uh, ridiculing the map earlier for being so small and not as spacious, but they made up for it in the way the puzzles work with all the flying and how the evolutions actually affect the puzzles. It's really interesting. I never saw a game like this. We only need 10 more dots out of all 64 in order to get our next evolution, and I can't wait to see what that's going to be considering we have wings. Like, what can come next? Clearly something that allows me to get up here. Unless it's just one of those things where, yep, it's probably, yep, it's one of them. But maybe it's going to be something that allows me to get up there. Because I still can't get up there. That's clear. Hmm. What's all the way up here then? Oh wait, we've been up here. Next evolution. I have to get to you. In order to do that, I have to do a lot more. Making it so far. Darn it, only four more. That's an annoying way to do that. I have to take a fall. Looks like twice. Alright, got up here. Gotta get up to this next pillar. Yes. Now I gotta get this dot. Ah! There's one more there and we're missing two somewhere else. Where are we missing two dots? That's going to be a problem. Yay! I got a dot. Where are the other two? I don't know where to go. Up here, maybe? Hmm. A dot! I think I know where the last one is, then. It must be up here. It has to be. Oh god, please tell me I'm right. I'm tired of wings. It's not. It must be that last dot that I saw. Did it! I'm a flying beast now? As a flying beast, you can blast doors down. Yes! That's a way to finish the game. And there's no end to the flying anymore. Yes. This is a way to end the game. As a frickin' dragon. Just breaking doors down. Eating everything. I wonder what the last thing is then that I'm not even gonna get to probably play as. There's just hidden doors everywhere. I wondered why they were all locked up. I thought maybe it was going to be a more unique puzzle, but instead it's just a part of this thing. It's what it can do. It's why this thing is so important. There's another one in here. So I gotta get all the way up here and blast this door down. I need all these things. Wow! This game's been kind of a little bit puzzling, but it's also been kind of simple at the same time. It's a very simplistic puzzle game, but I've enjoyed it the whole time. Hasn't taken too long. It's a nice one-off, I'd say. Even if my commentation on it's not the best. It's not really what it's about. More just about letting you guys see the game. Oh. Well, there's like nothing up there. The whole idea of getting up there was just kind of not for anything this entire time. And that's kind of upsetting me, actually. I wish that was more worth it. I like how the background is literally just a checkerboard. Like, they didn't do anything to make it look nicer there. They just figured, oh, it's good enough. Like, I don't understand that. I guess it's because they didn't really have a concept for where this game took place. It's just, hey, you're you're like nothing now you're a dragon <laughs> that's that's the concept behind it we put some dots down in specific places now you can be a dragon here you go I can just shoot off flames all I want
stay on this ground because I want to make sure I'm on the level. Yes, more dots. Hundred and twelve out of hundred and twenty-eight. That gives us sixteen more. They can't be too far now. I think they're all in here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. You are strong enough to activate the fountain. Oh, the fountain! Now I understand. But where is the fountain? Hmm. So there's no next evolution after the dragon. We just have to activate the fountain to win, I am assuming. Wherever the fountain is. I don't know where that is. That's the problem with this. It's the highest point, maybe, in the game. All the way up here. Yeah, definitely, because I haven't gone through here. Oh, there's one last part of this, I guess. A maze. Okay, I see. Fountain's not in there. Is it over here? Nope. Up here? Maybe? Looking like it. Shoot down all those doors. And activate the fountain. As your life force is drained, you feel the fountain. You want to be one with it. You, your vision is getting blurry. But you feel at peace. You accept your faith gladly. By sacrificing yourself. You have restored the flow. And saved the world. There will be tales. And songs about you. For all eternity. Thank you for playing. Okay. Well, this has been Pix Evo. Uh, interesting little game. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and as always, see you next time.